Hi everybody, welcome to George Moore Chevrolet. My name is Sam Martins. I'll be showing you this 2024 Chevrolet Corvette C8. This is a 2024 with the Accelerate Yellow external color. It's also a Z51, which we'll go over in just a moment for those of you who are unfamiliar with the package. Um, same as the previous generations for the Corvette, you're gonna have a uh, very similar aero, uh, very minor differences in that end. Coming around the side of the vehicle over here, you can have, have these multi-spoke wheel, uh, wheels with your Z51 specific calipers. It's one way to tell it's a Z51, it's by the calipers having that specific marker. On the inside, you're gonna have a jet black interior, GT1 seats, and then as far as the interior, we'll go over on the other side and we'll speak about it in just a moment. Coming around the back of the vehicle over here, here's the part where most people like to spend the most time. This is a 6.2 liter V8 LT2. Uh, it's still a 6.2 liter, very similar to the LT1 that we had in the C7 generation of the Corvette, but it produces 495 horsepower, and it is sent through a dual-clutch transmission produced by Tremec. Uh, the vehicle has a 0-60 to 60 time with the Z uh, Z51 package of about 2.9 seconds and about 184 miles an hour, uh, which is electronically controlled in a close road circuit. Come around the side of the, pass, uh, the driver's side. If we take a look in here, we can see everything's driver oriented. Very little is pushed towards the passenger side and you have your mode shifter as well as other options on the inside that we'll go over in just a moment. One of the biggest ones that people like, uh, like to have in their vehicles is your heads up display. Considering the vehicle, you know, most of the time you're gonna be looking straight ahead. But now we're gonna move over to the vehicle's interior to talk about some of its more interesting features. All right, everybody, now we're in the inside of our Corvette. We wanna start off here at the very top like we usually do. Vehicle is still equipped with OnStar, so you have your anti-theft vehicle recovery and engine kill. One thing that is relocated that a lot of people might not know and they're looking for it down here is your lane keeping. It's actually up here next to your warning lights. Down from that, in terms of the infotainment system, you have a new and updated infotainment system with our new um, display. So you have Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, of course. But one of the biggest things that I love to show anybody who is going into one of these vehicles is this. This is your mode shifter system, showing you different animated internals to the vehicle itself, such as my mode. This vehicle is equipped with your front lift memory, which means it will raise the vehicle, the vehicle's front, allowing for more clearance in case you're going over bumps. Your transmission can be put into a pseudo manual mode by pressing that button. Of course, you have to be in drive, but it being a DCT, it will shift like a manual does instantaneously. You have your Z mode right here, pressing that button will put you into Z mode, which allows you full customization of the vehicle's behavior, including its uh, steer, feel, engine response, engine sound, etc. You have your front to collision, and of course your flat bottom steering wheel and flat top too. Uh, heated steering wheel as well. You have power folding mirrors with blind spot sensors. And here's one of the coolest things. Take a look behind me. A glass panel separating you from your engine, but that is a fully open design to the engine itself. If we take a look back at the front, we have a camera mirror as well for better visibility considering the way that the vehicle itself is designed. And then overall, as far as your interior, you still have this uh, customizable frontal display uh, with the animations that come into the vehicle as well. So overall, this is an awesome, awesome uh, C8 Corvette for anybody who is looking to get into a C8, specifically a brand new C8. Um, come down to George Moore Chevrolet and see me, Sam Martin. Hopefully, we can have you this monster home.